Welcome to Honey's Easy Max. Today we are discussing the new unit ratio and proportion. First we learn ratio. Before that, let's do an example. Cost of a teddy bear is 250 rupees. Cost of a chocolate is 50 rupees. First we calculate the difference of the cost. That means 250 minus 50. That is equal to 200. So the difference of the cost between them are 200 rupees. Then we calculate by division. 250 by 50. We get 5 by 1. That means the cost of teddy bear is 5 times of a chocolate. So Comparison by division is the ratio. Ratio consists of how many times a number contains another. And the ratio is denoted by the symbol like colon. Example 8 to 10, 3 to 9. ratio of 93 to 63. To find the ratio 93 is divided by 63 and we can divide both numerator and denominator by 7 because it's a common factor that is equal to 14 by 9. So the ratio of 93 to 63 is equal to 14 to 9. So to find the ratio of any two numbers, write it in fractional form and find the simplest form. That is the answer of the question. There are 20 girls and 50 boys in a class. What is the ratio of number of girls to the number of boys. Number of girls is 20 by to the number of boys is 15. So first we find the simplest form. 20 by 15 both divided by 5. So we get 4 by 3. The ratio of number of girls to the number of boys is equal to 4 to 3. What is the ratio of number of girls to the total number of students in the class? So first we find the total number of students by adding number of girls and number of boys. Number of girls is 20 plus number of boys is 15. We get 35. So the number of students write as a numerator. That means 20 by total number of students, 35 as denominator. 20 and 35, both divided by 5, we get 4 by 7. So the ratio of number of girls to the total number of students in the class is equal to 4 to 7. 9 kilometer to 12 kilometer. Here the unit are also seen. So 9 by 12. We can divide both numerator and denominator by 3. We get 3 by 4. So 9 kilometer to 12 kilometer. The ratio is 3 to 4. Next example is 4 meter to 20 centimeter. Here the units are different. One is meter and one is centimeter. So to first we convert them into same unit. For that meter is converted to centimeter. 4 meter is equal to 4 into their power of relation is 100. So we get 400 centimeter. Next we find the ratio. 400 divided by 20. 400 and 20 can be divided both 
20. We get 20 by 1. So the ratio 4 meter to 20 centimeter is equal to 20 to 1. 30 minutes to 1.5 hours. Two quantities can be compared only if they are in same unit. Here, one is in minutes and one is in hours. So, we can change these units in one. 1.5 hours can be written as 1.5 into 60 that is equal to 90 minutes here one point hours change into minutes 90 minutes then we can find the ratio 30 minutes to 1.5 hours that means 30 by 90 and we can divide these numbers both by 30 by 30 we get 1 by 3 so the ratio of 30 minutes to 1.5 hours is equal to 1 to 3